Hey, this is Andy Brown, head instructor at the Climber School of Real Estate in Orlando, Florida, and I'm about to do another math video tutorial question for you. This one is number seven on the 10 question math exam we have on our website, climberrealestateschool.com. All right, let me read it to you. A business owner negotiates a variable lease for his business. He begins his lease at $2,000 per month. The index at the time is 175. One year later, the index has increased to 185. What is his new monthly rent? This is officially called a variable lease problem or a variable index lease problem. And there's a good chance you'll get one like this on your state exam. I want to show you an easy way to do it. So let's talk about the relevant information. First of all, the base monthly rent is $2,000 a month. Now, at the time they signed the lease, the old index was 175. Later on, could be a year, whatever, doesn't matter, but the new index is 185. The question is, what is the new rent? Well, I'm going to show you something uh, I call a little trick to help you get this at the run the state exam. I call it divide by the old and multiply by the new. So let me show you how this works. You take the rent, by the way, that they're going to give you on the state exam, divide by the old, 175. That equals 11.43. And then you multiply by the new, which they will give you on the state exam. And that gives you 2,114. And that is the answer. That's all you have to do for a variable lease index problem. If you have any other questions, contact us here at the school, 407-822-3926. Remember, the Climber School of Real Estate is the best real estate school in Florida. Why don't you come in and experience the Climber School difference for yourself?